There's been a lot of interest recently in Native American running, but most folks don't really actually know that much about Native American running and just how vibrant and interesting and diverse the traditions of running are for uh, athletics, for community building, for ritual, and they really go all the way from, from the Arctic all the way down to the tip of South America. And so it's not surprising that you know, some of the great runners have been and remain uh, Native Americans. And so many people don't know that the Boston Marathon has been won by a number of Native American runners, and one of them was 80 years ago uh, this year by a guy named Tarzan Brown when he was having this duel with the famous Johnny Kelly. There was a Boston Globe reporter watching it in the Newton Hills. There was at one point when Tarzan Brown apparently kind of broke away from Kelly. They tapped him on the shoulder and then zoomed up the hill. And the reporter said that he broke Kelly's heart. Brown went on to win the marathon that year and that's how the Heartbreak Hill got its name. We do have runners. These men would go from tribe to tribe or village site to village site delivering the messages, you know, whether it was war or peace or, or anything like that. They were message deliverers. Within the Wabanaki Confederacy, which consists of Passamaquoddy, Penobscot, Dickback, and Maliseet, each tribe had their own runners that would deliver you know, the, the wampum belts. So we're trying to continue to inspire athletics with our, with our youth. Let them know that running is a part of our culture. It's in our DNA, not just as a sport, but like almost as like a ceremony in itself. You have your own personal connection with the Great Spirit when you're running. You know, we have a physical inactivity epidemic throughout the United States and really growing throughout the entire world. You know, the Native American communities have also been hit by this epidemic of physical inactivity. And we have a lot to learn from Native American running traditions, but also I think we as a community can also help foster and uh, promote Native American running as well as running uh, in every community. You know, I really honestly believe that if we can get more people out there being physically active, whether it's running or, or whatever, uh, we can make the world a better place. And so, and that's really what, what this is all about.